gerunds are words that are formed with verbs but act as nouns. They are very easy to spot, since every gerund is a verb with intact to its tail. There are no exceptions to this rule. Like all things grammar, gerunds do take a tiny bit of detective work to spot. The problem here is that present participles also end with the letters ing. Besides being able to spot gerunds, you should be able to tell the difference between a gerund and a present participle. Let's go back to the definition of a gerund for a moment. Remember that gerunds are words that are formed with verbs but act as nouns. Present participles do not act as nouns. Instead, they act as modifiers or complete progressive verbs. To find a gerunds in sentences, just look for a verb plus thing that is used as a noun. It's that simple, examples of gerunds as you read these examples of gerunds, notice the verbs they contain, and notice that every single one of them ends in ing. By the end of this quick lesson, you'll have no problem recognizing gerunds when you see them. Swimming in the ocean has been Sharon's passion since she was five years old. The ballerina taught us dancing. Apologizing to me isn't enough this time. She is afraid of flying. They are capable of doing hard work. 